Hi, this is Raven and I'm going to cover unit respawns as requested by subscriber Firebox415. So firstly put down a unit. Now to put down a single respawn is quite simple. The first thing you have to do is go to attributes, multiplayer and in the respawn section click respawn on custom position and I just untick everything in here so there's two ways of doing a simple single respawn position you can go to systems and type in respawn And you've got respawn position module. You put that down, open it up, and in here we've got the side. So just put blue four because that's what our unit is. Show two. You can have everyone or only this side. And that's that. An even easier way of doing it is if you go to markers and type in empty see empty marker there drag that down and for the markers it will go to the 2d map so you can only see on the 2d map so double click on it and then in the variable name just type respawn underscore west now the west um, means blue for now in the text this is what the actual marker will be known as so we'll just call it doc respawn you'll see why later and that's it it's that simple um, you have to with respawns you have to save the file so you have to export it as multiplayer because respawns don't work if you play the scenario like a preview now having more than one respawn point is a little bit more involved but it's not too bad so I'll just show you go back to attributes multiplayer back in the respawn section and in here select respawn position so you want to tick that and then respawn delay you can just change that to I'll give it five seconds and then what we're going to do is we're going to say we're going to have another one inside the town so let's put a spawn there so we want respawn underscore west underscore two this one's going to say ta town respawn fat fingers right town respawn so now what will happen is when the mission starts you'll get these two pop up so you can start at either one which is fine if that's what you want if you want to be able to start anywhere in the map but if you want a mission where you have one respawn to begin with and then you unlock another respawn then I'll show you how to do that I'll just quickly show you what it will look like And there you go. So you can see you've got the dock respawn and the town respawn. So you can choose either. Okay, so say you want this town respawn to be unlocked. So let's delete that. And what we can do 
is just put a trigger down and say you wanted the respawn to unlock when you clear the town so let's just go to a civilian because he's easy to kill we'll call him C1 so So not a live C1 like I've shown you on the other videos. So when he dies this trigger is going to activate. And I'm just going to paste on activation this code in. And I'll put this in the video comments so you can copy and paste it. So we're going to create a marker. Respawn West 2. Now these coordinates we'll come back to in a minute. Uh, marker type is the empty and we want it to be called town respawn so we're just okay that for now and then we go to where we want the marker so I think it was about there go to log and log position on clipboard okay copy and paste it into a notepad file and then go back to your trigger and then select that make sure not to get the brackets and paste it on top of that okay so that's where it's going to stick the marker okay so now when we shoot him it will give us another option for respawning and I'm just going to put down an ammo box just to make sure I've got enough grenades to kill myself I think that'll do okay let's try that so don't forget to e export it to multiplayer right so the mission has just loaded in and as you can see only the dock respawn as highlighted so we'll respawn in and if we kill our civilian that should activate the trigger now we'll kill ourselves as you can see we've now unlocked the town respawn